Hi, it's Katie. Let's talk about PSAT scores. So the great news is no matter how you did, by taking the PSAT, you've already started studying for the SAT or the ACT, so you should feel really good about that. The next thing that you need to do is check out your score report. You'll be able to go through individual questions and see what you got right, what you got wrong, and where are your biggest opportunities for improvement. If you're a really high scoring student, then A, congratulations, and B, go talk to your counselor, and you should expect to hear from the National Merit Scholarship Corp sometime in the future about your status. The next thing that you need to do is pick an SAT or ACT test date. This will help you plan ahead and you can use your PSAT scores as a jumping off point to set your goal for these exams. You don't know what your goal is? Then check out our downloadable where you can figure out what the right goal score is for the schools that you want to apply to. And then figure out your prep plan. If you need any help or if you have any questions about these exams, first subscribe to our channel. If you have questions about the PSAT, leave us some comments below and we'll get back to you.